Hi guys, welcome back to Geezer Grills. Today we're going to do something that I call quick chicken. Now let me set the scene for you. All right, it's Friday, you just got in, you've been knocking your fucking pipe out all day, you're desperate to get out for a few beers. What's the first thing you've got to do? Ask your missus if you're allowed to go. No, after that, hope she wants to come with you. After that, <laughs> you've got to make something to eat, and it's got to be quick, so I call this quick chicken. What we have in front of us here is I have chopped up two chicken breasts into thin slices, okay? The rub is so straightforward, it's unbelievable. I literally have a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of cracked black pepper, and then I have a tablespoon of brown sugar. That is literally all I'm gonna put in here. That goes into there, and we're gonna mix this whole lot up. It is one of the easiest, quickest, fastest, hence the name quick chicken, or fast chicken, whichever way you wanna call it. We're gonna mix this all up together, and it just cures really quickly, really fast and it's literally ready to go. Other than that, what we're gonna do is we're literally gonna be making, well, tortillas, tacos, depends which country you're from, I suppose. But they're literally, we call them wraps over here. <laughs> okay, they're gonna be quick, they're gonna be fast, and they're gonna fill a hole, and you get yourself back out. That's all the plan is, all right? So, as you can see, pepper, salt, brown sugar. There is all to it, I promise you. But I guarantee you, the taste profile, you're going to be over the moon, especially if you're saying this fast. It's the, probably the first time in your life you're going to be like, <laughs> it's probably going to be the first time in your life you're glad to be do, do something quickly, you know what I mean? Anyway, that is literally it as far as the, the, the goes. Next thing we're going to do is I've chopped up some onion. I bought myself literally some crunchy salad, and that's it. Tortillas, job done. Mayo for a dressing. I guarantee you. Fucking hell, 15 minutes, you'll be out the door having a jar at a local pub. We will be cooking this on the Pit Boss griddle, which is just firing up over there. I've only got three burners on, so we're gonna take you over there and get this bad boy ready to go. Let's rock and roll. Right guys, we're at the griddle. As you can see, literally three burners, don't need the other two. We're only gonna be a small bit of chicken going in there. There ain't a big cooking area that we're gonna need. Everything is ready for us to rock and roll. And I mean, on a serious note, I told you it'd be quick, but quick is not the fucking word today. It is gonna be double lively. All right, what we're gonna do, little drop of oil in the middle. All right, take one of these bad boys, give it a little squidge around. The only thing I'm gonna do is just slightly bring up these burners a little bit more. So we've got a nice squidge of oil in the middle there. I do love this machine, honestly. It just saves so much fucking around, especially like I said, quick chicken. I can almost taste that pint already. Look at that. Right, once that is done, we are simply gonna whack the chicken on. I uh, told you it's gonna be quick. Are you ready for the sizzle? Here comes the sizzle. And all you're gonna do is move that around. Just like we always do on one of these griddles. For such a simple rub, you are gonna be shocked at how nice this tastes, I promise you. It is gonna be fucking handsome. And as promised, it won't be long before you're out the door. Now it's funny, you know, for such a quick and simple dinner, it's amazing how good it tastes. Look at that. We are practically nearly there already. One of these, perfect little bit of kit, well worth your money. All it does is it holds your wraps, so when you're making them up, it makes life a lot easier. There we go. You can see that cracked back better on there. You try saying that. that's fucking easy for you to say. You can see that cracked black pepper on there. That is going to be tasting fucking lovely. As I said to you on previous videos, the key to using this griddle, especially when you're cooking meat this thin, is just keep it moving. Keep it moving. We are rocking there. Let that sit for a little while. And as I said to you, all we're literally going to do is we've got a bag of crunchy salad. A little bit of onion to give it a bite. Bosh. <laughs> now, before I said Heinz once before, this is Hellman's mayonnaise. Not the fucking, not the, not the diet one, for fuck's sake. Do me a favor, Will. We want some flavor in there, yeah? Out of that door quicker than you know it. Do you know it's funny? 
this sort of food, when you see this chopping away like this, it just it reminds me of this time when I was in Thailand, in this one of these bars, right? And uh, I see this fucking, I see this bird over the road. I see this bird over across the dance floor. She's done this beautiful red dress. She's looking over at me, big long split on it. Oh, gosh, she was gorgeous, she was. And uh, she's looking over me, she catches me eye. I think, oh, fucking hell. Anyway, I think, what's going on here? She starts to walk over, doesn't she? Starts making her way over to me. I think, I think, oh, fucking hell, what's going on? What's going on, for fuck's sake? Whatever you do, don't get an old one, don't get an old one. Whatever you do, don't get an old one. So anyway, I start looking around, don't I? I'm like looking around, trying not to catch her eye, I'm not, trying not to catch her eye. And I think, fucking hell, please, please, whatever you do, whatever you do, she's getting closer across the dance floor. She's literally about four, literally about fucking ten foot away from me. I'm saying to myself, oh, please don't get an old one. Please don't get an old one. She was so fit. It was unbelievable. So I said, please don't get an old one. Please don't get an old one. Anyway, she only fucking did. <laughs> Can't beat the old ones, can you? Can't beat the old ones. Such a simple dish. Now, I mean, to be fair, you can, you can boost this up wherever you want. You could even chuck a bit of soy sauce in there if you wanted to, but just before you try messing around with it, just try this little simple, this simple uh, flavour profile. Just give it a go before you start fucking around with it. I mean, you can throw some peppers and onions in there if you really want to do it, but what the whole point of this is, quick chicken. You know what I mean? Like I said, sir, the key is to get out the door as fast as we can. That is just about there. Now, I know it don't look like there's a lot of flavour on there, but I promise you, it really doesn't. It's just, I, but I promise you, just try it. Literally try it, because I was shocked when I first had a stab at this. Just a quick, fast fix. Very fast. That is literally, let's try a little bit, shall we? Let's try a little bit in there. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. so simple. So simple. Oh, it's lovely, that is. I am going to say that we are done. Spread it back, spread that back. Pop those in there. Right, next thing. Wraps. Let's warm up one. These ain't nothing special. These come from Asda's boys. Nothing exciting at all. Put that on there, let's get this warmed up. Lovely. Come on, baby. Don't think I'm showing off, put me hand on here. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Only joke. Here we go. Come on. Oh, it's starting to look like, oh, I literally can't wait. I'm literally fucking starving. We're just about ready. As I said to you, these little machines here, fucking ideal. Perfect, look at that, all fits in there. Happy days. Now, what I like to do, I like to take mayonnaise, I like to put a little squidge in there. All right, then I add the chicken. Just in there, bosh, bosh. A little bit more, bosh. Then, I personally, I like to put the onion in now. Just a little bit of red onion. Just gives it a little something. It's not, like I say, this ain't fucking rocket science here. This is not a fucking major, major meal. Well, this ain't something you might serve up for your bird if you're trying to impress her. It's something to get you out that door, double lively, you know what I'm saying? Right, and then, a little bit of lettuce on the top. Fucking hell, I mean, we're not wilting the lettuce. Let's get that in there. And then the other thing that I like to do is literally just give it a little squidge on the top of that, like that. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is what we call quick chicken. Uh -huh. Oh, salt, salt, cracked black pepper, brown sugar, oh, onion, mayonnaise. I promise you guys, everyone is a winner. You cannot be upset. I would not be upset if someone served that up to me. Two of these, you're out the door, in the pub. Oh. Oh. Seriously. I have that bit of that and all. 
You've got to trust me on this one. It's one of the most simplest recipes. Fast chicken, quick chicken, whatever you want to call it. We'd even call this get me out the fucking door chicken, do you know what I mean? So I just promise you, such a simple, simple mix. But the flavour profile is right. Highly, re highly recommend it, guys. And uh, I shall see you next time. Mmm, beautiful. Oh. Just one other thing. <laughs> Don't forget to press all the fucking buttons.